knock on our door. Come and knock on our door. We've been waiting for you. We've been waiting for you. Where the kisses are. Hers and hers and his sweet company too. There are three main heaters located on the first floor. Um, one of them is behind the couch, so I've moved the couch out for you guys to see. And the way you turn the heaters on is that there's always a switch next to it. And in order to turn it on, you're going to push the switch down. It should be red on top, and the top should be out, and that means the heater is turned on. In order to turn it off, you just push it back in, and your heater will be off. Now the other one is located in the kitchen. And the kitchen heater works exactly the same. Right next to the heater there is a switch and you push it down and then it's on. The final main heater is next to your staircase. And this is the heater that you can leave on at all times throughout the night. Um, during the day it conserves the heat and during the night it lets it out slowly so your house is going to be heated for the entire day afterward. Um, and that switch is actually located by the nearest couch. And it's right back here. And if you flick that on, your main heater's on. So every heater has its own switch. One of the really nice things, though, is that your house comes with what is called a fireplace. But there's no actual fire. And the switch for this is located underneath this gold plate right here. Now, there are four different settings for this. The first one is lights. And the setting for that looks like this. It's a little light bulb. And that's just having the lights on. No heat is actually coming out of this right now. The next one is the first setting. And that has one line. And then that'll heat up the first coil down here. The second setting has two lines. And that'll heat up two coils. And as you can see, when the coils heat up, they turn a bright orange. And the last setting is the third setting, and then it heats up all three coils. Now this shouldn't be left on for long periods of time because it gets really, really hot. Um, so you shouldn't leave it on when you leave the house or overnight or anything like that because you have the other main heaters to keep the house heated during those times. Okay, so there's also two sets of heaters upstairs, one in each bedroom, and these are exactly like the heaters downstairs, except for they're smaller, and they turn on exactly the same way. You just flip the switch, and when you see the red, it's on, and flip it to turn it off. And um, these should only be left on for a couple hours at a time. Um, you can leave them on overnight if it gets really cold, but most of the time, just leave them on a couple hours when you're here, and make sure you always turn them off when you leave. Come and dance on our floor. Come and dance on our floor. 